Hi, I'm Dr. Max, and uh, we're here today in Max Medical Robotic Hair Transplant Clinic in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Uh, let's talk a, a little bit about facial hair restoration. Facial hair restoration became an important uh, topic for any hair transplant surgeon uh, because uh, fashion and uh, styles change. A lot of men are looking to have a fuller, healthier appearing beard. For women, we can discuss improving uh, look with eyebrows. Let's discuss some options that we have uh, and ways to restore facial hair. Uh, we can use the same FUE technique as we use for uh, uh, scalp hair restoration. Basically, FUE stands for follicle unit instruction, to be precise, follicle unit excision. We take those hair follicles one by one from the back or side of the head until we get enough grafts to cover the area that we intend to transplant. There is not much difference how we obtain the grafts except for, for example, for the beard. There are some areas that will require um, a slightly thinner or slightly coarser grafts and this is where FUE technique is actually more useful than an older technique like FUT. FUT, we are only working with the grafts that are taken from the back of the head from the same area. With FUE technique, we can actually obtain any graft from the donor area, from the safe zone, starting from temples or occipital parts. So we have more flexibility and we can actually pick and choose the graft that will be more suitable for the procedure that we plan. Um, there are different styles of beard and this is what we do typically before we plan the, the actual hair restoration procedure. We sit, we have a very organized discussion, what we're trying to achieve, how uh, thick is the beard, where to transplant. And once we derive with the plan, um, then we actually schedule the procedure. Um, the results take from four to five months to see some initial growth and up to 12 months and sometimes a little bit longer to see the final result. One thing that's important to realize is that um, even we take the hair from the back of the head and we transplant to the facial area, the hair will act the same way as your scalp hair. So, uh, people who decide that they do want to have a uh, facial hair transplant, they do need to be prepared to trim the hair frequently, to groom it so it doesn't grow very long. Uh, same thing applies to uh, eyebrow restoration for women. Or anyone who had a, some traumatic um, injury, um, which resulted in the facial hair loss. For men, it could be also uh, an option to have uh, eyebrows transplanted. It's the same technique, the FUE, follicular unit excision technique, from um, the back or the side of the head. If you decide to schedule a consultation, you can do it either with our hair consultant, which is free, complimentary, or uh, with me, where we uh, will plan to do a detailed uh, microscopic hair analysis, uh, health history review, um, you know, possible uh, 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 digital imaging to give you some idea how the final result might look like. Uh, so with any questions, call us or visit our website, bringbackhair.com.